When I first moved to the city, I went out a couple times with this girl, really hot, great kisser, but she had the biggest Adam's apple. <laughs> Uh, Joey, women don't have Adam's apples. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are messing with me, right? Mess with someone. To tease, mock, confuse, or puzzle someone. To treat someone in a bad, rude, or annoying way. Examples. Now all the lying and the secrets will finally be over. Or, we could not tell them we know, and have a little fun of our own. <laughs> oh, I, I would enjoy that. How, how are we gonna mess with them? Oh. Well, you know, every time that they say they're like doing laundry, we'll just give them a bunch of laundry to do. All right, what is your deal? <laughs> Excuse me? Inviting my girlfriend to come see your electron accelerator? Relax, I am not interested in your girlfriend. I hope not, because you don't want to mess with me. I'm crazy. <laughs> I believe you. This house is great. Really? What changed your mind? Oh, well, the little girl who lives here made me feel a lot better about the whole thing. Joey, there was a little girl who lived here, but she died like 30 years ago. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Salad. Here's your pizza. And thanks to Sheldon's heated discussion with my manager, one barbecue bacon cheeseburger, barbecue sauce, bacon, and cheese on the side. Thank you. Go ahead, eat it. <laughs> I dare you. I dare you. Used for challenging someone to do something you believe they would not do because they are afraid or would be embarrassed. Examples. We went to a self-defense class today. Wow. Yeah, kicking a guy in the crotch all morning really takes it out of you. <laughs> no, now we can kick anybody's ass. Yeah. After one class, I don't think so. What, you wanna see me self-defend myself? Go over there and pretend you're a sexual predator. Go on, I dare ya. <laughs> are there any chopsticks? You don't need chopsticks, this is Thai food. Here we go. <laughs> Thailand has had the fork since the latter half of the 19th century. Interestingly, they don't actually put the fork in their mouth. They use it to put the food on a spoon, which then goes into their mouth. Ask him for a napkin, I dare you. I am a diapering master. I have done little else in the past two months. There is nothing I cannot diaper. Go ahead, try to think of something. I dare you. Starving. Come on, guys, suck it up. We're closing in on 10 hours. It's gut check time. Suck it up. Used for saying that someone has to accept a difficult or unpleasant situation, even if they do not want to. Examples. Has it occurred to you you're missing the big picture? If you look at neutron scatter oh, data. Penny, Penny. What's up? Nothing. I just wanted to make Raj stop talking. <laughs> no, no, no. He won. Suck it up. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Well, I guess you can start by driving a cab on another world. What? That audition? That's a two-line part. <laughs> Joey, you owe $1,100 at I Love Lucite. <laughs> so what? So suck it up, man. It's a job. It's money. Which X? Which one's X? The one with the X on it. Take it easy. I'm new at this. What, the alphabet? <laughs> the game or do you want to crawl back up your mommy's shirt and chow down like a baby? Damn, what is wrong with you? Sorry, I thought you wanted to beat your husband. I do! Oh, suck it out! What are you doing here? Well, if I had to guess, I'd say I'm here because you saw me earlier this evening and you're still hung up on me. No, I'm not. Be or get hung up on someone or something. To be extremely interested in a particular subject and spend an unreasonably large amount of time thinking about it. To be obsessed with someone or something. Examples. I think my boyfriend's ever so dreamy. <laughs> I wonder what our wedding's gonna be like. <laughs> what are you talking about? What wedding? Come on, like you never talk about that? No, never. I mean, we're just living in the moment. 
Kai, it is so nice for once not to get all hung up on where's this going. Thanks, that was fun. Yeah, I really enjoy spending time with you. You're a very nice person. Thank you. I'm so glad you were Jim. He was hung up on Pam for such a long time. I didn't think he'd ever get over her. And I challenge you to a snowball fight on the first real snow of winter. You got it. That sounds awesome. Can we all do it? No, Andy, it's a snowball fight. It's not fun. Go get your own thing. Beat it. Beat it. Used for telling someone to go away, leave immediately. Especially when you are angry with them. Examples. Come on, I'll give you a tour. Bienvenido to the bedroom. Take this. King size bed, full size blanket, one pillow. Everything about this bed says our work here is done. <laughs> Next, we say bienvenue to the bathroom. What? Only one towel? What? No hair dryer? You know where I keep that stuff? Your place. Beat it. Look, here's my car. Maybe we can get a drink this weekend. Oh, I don't know. I'm pretty busy. I have to inventory all the giveaways. Hey! Beat it! Shoo! <laughs> so what did he want? Nothing. He offered her a job. No one wants a tattletale, Karen. <laughs> so it's up, traitor. Damn it, Karen! <laughs> Suck it up, man. It's a job. It's money. Go ahead. Eat it. I dare you. It's a snowball fight. It's not fun. Go get your own thing. Beat it. I'm not interested in your girlfriend. I hope not. Because you don't want to mess with me.